Creativity is an addiction. We live with it. We have to learn from it. And more importantly, yeah, we sometimes we have to just say, uh uh-uh, ain't going to happen. And when that happens, your creativity is going to turn into a child and it's going to have a screaming fit. Unplug because we will always say yes to creativity. Totally uncut because we all make mistakes. So turn it into a tool. This is Arrow Unplugged. I'm a stream thinker. I utilize the strength of being in the presence of now to be able to think about what is now. You can't be anywhere but right here, which is the now. That's how you grow forward. Understanding that, sure, you can have a vision and you can have a past that, that basically it was the process of getting here. You've had lots of events and you've had to be held accountable for them. But when you're living in the presence of now, being a stream thinker, what happens is, is that you make the best decisions. Every day I practice this. One page, 10 minutes to write, absolutely no editing whatsoever because it gives us plenty of time to talk about it in the end. This is Stream Thinking. April 17th, 2022, the focus was put on personal growth. And as we grow, how far do we reach? Now, mentally, as, as, as a regular person, I'm learning how to be present with this place of now. I do this each and every day. Physically, the past two annual doctor visits find my height dropping nearly two inches, growing. My front lawn stopped, so therefore I planted more trees. It became a forest not understanding what the umbrella above me would do. Dictionary.com says, grow means to undergo a natural development. Through age and maturity, you start to realize how important it is to recognize the struggles caused by dreams and personal expectations. In a world of religion, you might hear, is this where God wants me to be? As we grow, are you taking notes? Maybe the question should be, should we be taking notes? What is your outreach? Through the power of being present in the community, there is unpredictable growth. The next step is ultimately a choice that becomes a seed. Growth. We're always hearing about growth. The economy. Did it grow? Is it falling backwards? I mean, you see prices. You're you're having to pay at the pump. You see what's going on with the supply chain. And now we've got this problem with baby formula growth. What is the growth? They're saying that we are growing, but yet we see things that that makes it look like that we're stepping backwards. How do you learn how to trust and grow within growth? Being aware. And I am a firm believer that you've got to be aware by way of taking notes. Stephen Furtick of Elevation Church said something very, very positive yesterday. And that was, is that the events that you have in your life affect the decisions that you make. The events Us being together right now is an event. Your decision will be, do I use it as a seed to grow or do I just turn this guy off because he's a quack? The events of our life. But in order to get to those events, there was a series of events that had to create this event. This didn't just happen. And what you do with your decision, which is the reason why when I stream think it is about being present in the place of now. The events was me getting to that moment where I was using a writing instrument. Now, what am I going to do about it? learning how to put the focus on yourself that is not conceited that is not too much confidence we can't do it alone but you can do yourself in a personal level of understanding where you are and then bring your experiences to the circle so that we can create a stronger more unified place once again the question is is that what is growth dictionary.com says to undergo a natural development through age and maturity you start to realize how important it is to recognize the struggles caused by dreams and personal expectations I understand that we all have dreams I didn't get to conquer mine I'm okay with that I've had to live with that this entire thing but it didn't stop me from doing what we're doing here today I didn't get to be that jock in Los Angeles you know like Ryan Seacrest but we got to be here in this event. What are we going to do with it? I'm Errol, and that's Stream Thinking.